Tammy and Merry Christmas! It is actually Christmas that I am filming this and hopefully if I have my life together, it is Christmas the day you are watching this. And as you can probably tell from the title, this is a what I got for Christmas video. I am super, super duper excited to show you what I got so without further ado, let's get into it. I'm gonna start out with my two biggest presents that I have right here to show you that I got for Christmas. Um, the first thing is this Calvin Klein wallet. I got this from my dad for Christmas, so thank you, dad. Um, it is just this like taupey faux leather wallet with this uh, Calvin Klein logo on the front in gold. I quite like this because I needed a new wallet. The one I was using I just got from um, Burlington Coat Factory and it was cute. But this one's better, so I love it so much. And then my next big present is actually a three-way present between my dad, my bopshi, and my brother. They each paid a portion of it because it was a quite expensive gift I asked for. I used to have a pair of Ray-Bans just like these, but they got stolen at my job from my backpack. So I was super devastated, and now I got a new pair. So they came in a box like this inside of this case, and I got a custom pair, so I sent like my, my dad the link and um, he customized them the exact way that I wanted and ordered them for me and they just look like this. They are so freaking adorable. I wish I was filming this video outside so I could wear them in this entire video but oh my gosh I love these so much. Ah! So my customization that I got is I got them in the, I think it was the copper lines, like copper outside rim. And then I got the standard green lenses for Polaroid. Polaroid. I got the standard green Ray-Ban lenses, and then I got the dark brown things that go behind your ears. So I love these. I'm so happy that I got them. Thank you everyone in my family for splurging and putting your money together. I'm never taking these to work or a place where they're not gonna be on my face because I don't want these ones to get stolen. The next two big presents that I got, I actually cannot show you because they are too big. So I'm gonna input footage right now of them. I got this bedspread, it's from Sueño, um, but I think my dad got it on Amazon because Sueño doesn't exist anymore. And then I got this really super cute rug. It is also from Amazon. It was a deal. It was only like $84 and I absolutely love it. It's comfortable and plushy. And I, I like carpet but I can't have carpet because my dogs like to pee on carpet so we'll see how long this rug lasts. Anyone have any really good um, stain removing techniques for white carpet? Leave it in the comments below. Okay, the next thing that I got is from Urban Outfitters and I don't know really how I feel about Urban Outfitters. They have cute stuff around the holidays but overall their company is a little sketchy. But I have wanted this pillow for years off Urban Outfitters. And I finally got it. I don't know why there's something about this pillow that I love and I've always wanted it and it's, it's always been like $40 and I've always been like, okay, I'm gonna wait until it goes on sale and then it never goes on sale. So I put it on my Christmas list and my dad got it for me and I love it. And he actually was like, you should get me a pillow exactly like this for my, my office. And I'm like, dad, if I could afford a $40 pillow for you, I would, but I'm sorry, that's too expensive for me. I, I put this on my list thinking he wasn't even gonna get it and then when he got it, I was like, ah! The next two things that I got are also from Urban Outfitters. I got this little star, like, uh, ring holder thing. I'm gonna put it on my vanity. You guys know that I kind of have a thing for stars, so I saw this. Honestly thought it was gonna be a little bigger, but that's okay. This was $10. Jeez. That's Urban Outfitters. And then the last thing that I got is this mini set of Panatone notebooks. They just have like the little Panatone thing at the bottom, like this one is cyber yellow. <laughs> it's my favorite color. Um, I just got these for studying. They're really tiny and I can just fill them up with like quiz words and study with them. So I really like these. I also thought these were going to be a little bigger, but that's okay. I prefer that they're small because that way I can fit them in my miniature backpacks. The last thing I got from Urban Outfitters is this three-piece set. It comes with a perfume that is pistachio brulee scented, a rollerball that is fig du forêt for flavor scent, and then a the matcha hand cream. I get this hand cream every year because it's my favorite. The next thing I got as a present from my Bopshi, and she got me this little like thing from um, Bath and Body Works, and it looks like my dog, that's why she got it, and then she got me a eucalyptus thing to go up in it, so that's super cute, thank you Bopshi. She also got me this three ingredient kiwi lollipop that actually has a whole kiwi in it, and she got me this girly toolbox. 
I'm a tool person now. <laughs> um, but no, she knows I live alone and I don't really have like a hammer or like a screwdriver. So she got me this. So if I ever need to fix something, I don't have to call my dad. I'll still probably call him though because yikes. The next two things are kind of boring and they were kind of joke gifts because I've been telling my dad that I needed these things for months on months on months and he's always been like, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. And then he didn't get it. But he did get stuff. Um, this is a bike pump for my bike because I keep getting flat tires because I live in the desert and cactuses exist. So he got me this, it's a foot pump so I can pump up my bike if I'm ever on the go and I get a flat just until I can get to my next destination because I don't drive. I bike everywhere. And then an electric can opener because I don't know how to use a regular can opener. No shame. This is apparently really hard to find because they don't make them anymore. The next thing that I got are these hand towels for my kitchen. It's such a boring like adult haul. If you're a kid and you're expecting like a Polaroid camera and a MacBook Pro and a Nintendo Switch. Like no, I am an adult now, man. Just look at my famous birthdays page. Uh, so I got this striped one and this one with little X's on it. And I really like them. The next thing I got is this little thing of bath bombs from Target. They are winter wonderland scented. I haven't actually like Oof, they smell so good. I'm gonna use one of these today because, you know, you gotta take a nice bath on Christmas. They apparently, ooh, they smell like hot apple cider. Yes. And the last two things that I got are these candles. I collect these, well, okay. These candles come in these cute bowls and these bowls are the bowls that I use for my kitchen set, but there's no way to get these bowls unless you buy these $15 candles. So I keep buying these candles to collect more bowls because these are the cereal bowls that I use. Um, so yeah, I got two more of these so that way I can complete my collection and I can stop buying $15 candles just for the bowls. Camera ran out of memory, but I'm back. I remembered I got some gift cards that I wanted to show you guys just cause these were kind of like, I'm kind of to that age where for Christmas, instead of getting a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of presents, people just like to give me cash and gift cards. So I just thought I'd be curious to show you guys like what gift cards my family gets me and just, you know, show you into like what I buy on a daily basis. Um, a Fry's gift card. This is a grocery store where I live. Not Fry's Electronics, the other Fry's. So that's nice. A $25 Chipotle gift card because Chipotle is my life. Chipotle is my life. A $25 Amazon gift card. I'm gonna use this to buy something to improve my video quality here on YouTube, so that's lovely. Um, a $50 Target gift card. Target, it explains itself. I freaking love Target. And a $50 Sephora gift card. And then my brother gave me $20 cash and I won $4 in a scratch it lottery ticket because does anyone else's parents, no matter what age you are, get you scratch it lottery tickets for Christmas? Like I have gotten those since I was like five years old. And I don't know what my parents would have done if I won like $100,000 when I was five years old. Like they definitely would have taken it and spent it. Like there's no way they would have let me keep it, right? Luckily I've only ever won like $4, but still. Pretty sure it's illegal to let little kids scratch. <laughs> Congratulations, tickets. Okay guys, so that is it for this video and I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that you guys got good stuff for Christmas or I at least hope that you had a good Christmas. Remember, Christmas is about like what you got. It's about what you do on Christmas with your family or how you spend it by yourself. I'm spending Christmas today by myself and I'm planning on binge watching Yuri on Ice for the third time this month. <laughs> And um, drinking hot chocolate and taking a bath and just like having a pamper day because it's it's a special day. It's Christmas. So if you have not already subscribed, please be sure to. But if you are already subscribed and you have yet to turn on my notifications, click the bell to turn on notifications so that you can actually enjoy my content. Join the party. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Fwah.